the lesson of the moth. I was talking to a moth the other evening. He was trying to break into an electric light bulb and fry himself on the wires. Why do you fellows pull this stunt? I asked him. Because it is the conventional thing for moths? Or why if that had been an uncovered candle instead of an electric light bulb, you would now be an unsightly cinder. Have you no sense? Plenty of it, he answered. But at times we get tired of using it. We get bored with the routine and crave beauty and excitement. Fire is beautiful. And we know that if we get too close to it, it will kill us. But what does that matter? It is better to be happy for a moment and be burned up with beauty than to live a long time and be bored all the while. So, we wad all our life up into one little roll. And then we shoot the roll. That is what life is for. It is better to be a part of beauty for one instant and then cease to exist than to exist forever and never be a part of beauty. Our attitude toward life is come easy, go easy. We are like human beings used to be before they became too civilized to enjoy themselves. And before I could argue him out of his philosophy, he went and immolated himself on a patent cigar lighter. I do not agree with him myself. I would rather have half the happiness and twice the longevity. But at the same time, I wish there was something I wanted as badly. as he wanted to fry himself.